Hey, what's up guys? Dr. GT back with another GT5 video today. And I know I'm gonna do LSPDFR, but not yet. I wanted to do something awesome and I've been wanting to do this for a while. So we're gonna jump into this. We are doing a Los Santos Rescue V Patrol as the fire department and we're gonna be doing at the Los Santos International Airport Fire Patrol. Sadly, there's not a real authentic fire truck, but this is the best I could do. So we're gonna jump in this. We're responding now to a call of an airport fire. Now we don't know the details on it yet, Actually, we just got word of it. It's an Airbus 380 on fire. So let's go ahead and we're just right around the corner here. Let's pull up and let's see if we can actually help out with this fire. I know we only have but a little bit here, but this brush truck might do better than most. Looks like they've already got the area scened off. We've got LASD and airport security outside. Um, come on, open this up. We got to get through here. There we go. Okay, we'll just run it down. Oh wow, looks like there's news on scene. What are they aiming their... What are they aiming their their uh, cell phones at? Oh, that's a plane, dude. Dude, that's an airplane. It looks like a Korean Air. So, oh, which way do I go? Oh, looks like this guy's uh, navigating traffic telling me to keep going. I'm just gonna keep going, I guess. Okay, we'll go this way. Okay, looks like it's a plane out here, guys. We've got a Airbus 380 on fire. It looks like there's an engine on fire outside here of the airport. This is not looking good. Looks like they've got customs taken off. We've got this area blocked down safely. I don't know where to go. Let's pull up and see if we can uh, access some of the damage. It looks like uh, we've got uh, the people all around here. Oh wow, looks like they've got a little bunch of people parked over there. Or a whole bunch of people pulled out of the thing. Looks like they've got people over here too. I don't really know what to do at this point. Um, they've got this area blocked off. LASD's got that lane. This whole this whole place is shut off. Oh, there's people on the ground right there. What about this other side over here? Oh man, this is all on fire. I don't want to go around that Airbus. I want to get away from that thing real quick. I want to find out what's going on here before we move in. Probably gonna have to do some type of, uh, I don't know what I'm gonna do. Oh, okay, we've got, oh, we've got a whole bunch of people here that are on the ground and we've got fire waiting to take in that shot. Oh, that engine's on fire. Do you see that engine right there? Oh, wow. Let's move in and let's just try to take this engine out real quick. Let's get this engine taken out. That engine is on fire, guys. We have an Airbus 380 on fire in GTA 5. Let's move underneath it. I don't I don't think that was probably a good idea, but uh let's turn this thing around here. Keep spraying this engine out. Looks like we're not spraying the engine. Let's spray up. Spray up, pray up, whatever. Boom, there we go. I hope this engine uh, loses its, uh, its, its value very soon. We've got to get this thing stopped here. This is insane, guys. If we don't stop this, the engine's off on the plane. But if we don't get this leak fixed, and there's gonna be, you can see there's already fuel lines that have leaked gasoline or oil or whatever on the ground below the plane, it's already catching fire. So this is gonna be pretty bad if we don't get these fires out. All right, I think. All right, now after much uh, shooting, it looks like it's, uh, looks like the, that's taken care of. The engine is taken care of. The engine has been shut down for fuel. Okay, so we need to spray this fire down here and get this fire taken care of. I'm not sure what's going on with that, but we need to get this whole fire right here out.
All right, so it looks like uh, we've actually got the all the fires clear at this point. Looks like we are clear of fire, guys. Let's go ahead and let's uh, pull up here, and let's see if we can uh, see if the actual fire has been taken care of around the entire thing here. It looks to be okay. You hear a helicopter somewhere? I hear a helicopter. Okay, but it looks like the, the actual fire has been taken care of. Um, I think we are good. I think we should be good at this point. There's the fire. There's, there's the helicopter. It's an annihilator. Annihilator. I'm not what you're in. Let's kill that siren. Actually, let's turn that on, but let's do our... Uh, kill the... Uh, there we go. Alright, and I think we're done here. Let's go pull up here and see if we can help out with victims or anything. I don't think we need to do CPR, but let's go see if... Uh, they need anything else from us while we're here. Let's go look around. I'm gonna go ahead and get my mask off while we're, here, we're at the back of the truck, or the side of the truck. Alright, we are good. Let's go see. Hello, everyone. It looks like these people made it out with minor lung uh, abrasion or minor lung damage to the from the smoke. Apparently there was not anyone on the flight. They were just uh, they were just departing a uh, a a, ro a, a rollover flight. So there wasn't really no one on that big ass thing. It was just like you know these people. I guess right here, this multiple people, and it looks like everything's okay. So um, you know we got PD on scene taking care of everything. We've also got the they're gonna take care of everything else as far as going inside the airplane to make sure uh, there's no one hurt or there's I mean there's nothing in the plane that's going to catch fire again. And as you can see here, we've got the, looks like customs, U.S. Customs or uh, Secret Service or some type of specialty um, LASA um, corporation or servicing, whatever it is, to help with the uh, vehicles and security of the place while uh, we're out here. But that's cool they actually did this. So let's go ahead and uh, let's call that code four now. And um, hope you guys enjoyed that awesome little uh, bit of uh, driving around and, you know, simulating this thing. I liked it. I know I know I did. I like this brush truck a lot. Sadly, the lights don't shine that good, even with the Radiance mod I have in, but I don't know what's going on with that. I'll probably fix it later. But yeah, that's pretty much the uh, patrol I wanted to show you guys. Um, it looks like this is going to be it for now. I'm going to go ahead and get this thing back to where, uh, where we're going to get our patrol done, and I think we'll clear this up, and I guess they'll clear this up as soon as we hear word from LSIA International Association that uh, it's clear to uh, move that plane out of the way and taxi it back. But it looks like um, there'll be no more inbound flights for the next two or three hours as this, as this at this point. A couple of people got star flighted, but I'm not sure that they're hurt or anything. But that would be cool to get some scripts that like you can change the path in to make someone like fly in and pick someone up and leave like create a scenario where like you can take all the characters and stuff like with what they do like what they're doing right now but make them actually do a path of walking and do a certain thing when they get to a path or get in a truck and drive it to another place and get in the path and time all that perfectly the, the speed they're driving that would be cool to have a mod like that I know there's a mod mission thing you can do but I'm not sure but that's it's pretty cool got all these Pierce fire trucks in here all the links for everything I'm using is in the description by the way if you want to see them um, except for the Caprice, but the Caprice is mine. So uh, if you want to access that, contact me in my email and we can get that working. And um, yeah, we have the, uh, everything else is, should be good. Except for that plane, you can see it's got a lot of rupture damage, all that smoke and tar and debris on the side of it from, from the airplane being, uh, being on fire. Look, there's an annihilator, I guess U.S. Customs securing, making sure, making sure everything's going good. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed that video. Um, if you did, please leave a like on the video, and of course, share it with your friends and stuff, and check out uh, these other videos that are going to appear after this, and uh, let me know if you want to see um, what you want to see next and stuff like that. So yeah, uh, oh, also, don't forget to subscribe, subscribe, and yeah, all the links are in the description for all this stuff. I'm using Pierce Fire Truck uh, ambulances, um, I'm using some of the um, something slim SLR, awesome slick top gang unit model over there, Crown. I'm using some other vehicles that are slick top and everything else pretty much is released, even this. Um, yeah, see you later. Thanks.
Holy shit! Oh my god! Stop the fucking weapon! Oh my god, stop trapping! Taser deployed in one of the ground. What is up, everybody? Suck GC, coming back to you. Give this thing the lane. Zero point two B. Gun! Gun! Unit today, we're gonna be doing a real LED light bar on it. As you can tell, you're gonna move in or you're gonna move in. It's really nice. This model is available on the 